Hi, I'm Jenna Leonard from Joie Vive Rabbitry, and I'm making a video today to show how to properly hand pluck a French Angora rabbit. This is Calypso, and she is a senior fawn French Angora rabbit. She is a pluck rabbit, and the only way to know that is to go by the rabbit's lineage and pedigree, because there are pluck French and there are sheer French, and unless you know what's in your background, you're not going to know what you've got. Um, so this is a pluck rabbit, and you can see that her back is short, and along the sides is long. And the back here is where I've already plucked. So you can see that when this rabbit is plucked, she will never go bald all the way down to the skin. There's already a new coat already coming up. It's about an inch long. If you look in the wool on the sides, you can see this ring of more intense color. This is showing you where the new coat ends. So when we pluck this rabbit out, the coat will only come down to that far. It's not going to go all the way to the skin. So to pluck the rabbit, I like to use two hands, one on the rabbit, one on the wool. This keeps um, pull off the skin. I'll pull the skin taut with one hand and just pluck the rabbit. And I tell people that when they are plucking, it is not, because I've had people say to me, do I just grab it and rip it off, Jenna? And no, you don't. Um, it is not like picking apples. It is like picking grapes. You do not want to grab and twist the fiber and then pull it off like you would with an apple. You want to just gently pluck it off the rabbit like grapes. Um, it will only go down to that next level which we can already see. I've cleared out a good little spot there of that new coat. And there it is in my hand. Nice little bit of fiber that you can then just go right and spin. So this is a pluck rabbit, and that is how you pluck angora fiber. Stay tuned for another video on how to clip or shear a sheer-only French Angora rabbit. Thanks.